All right, we're live. Gonna go ahead and double check on YouTube that we're live. Looks like we are live. Give me a second. I have to share this live stream. One last place to share. All right, here we go. It's time to begin. Remember that you're blessed, your honor, my friends. To a uh, me, oh, welcome back to the Blood Summer Seven Channel. Today we're back in again with part five of Days Gone. A little bit of a recap, so we can get this done now of the way, so we can get started on the stream. Uh, turns out when we went back to see Boozer, uh, he had gotten blood poisoning. And because of this, we needed to return to a place that originally told us if they saw us again, they'd kill us. And that was Lost Lake. We made it back, almost made away with the drugs, but we were caught by Addy and Ricky. Addy and Ricky understood what needed to happen. They went and helped Boozer. They brought him in. They started doing what they could. And we went to talk to Iron Mike. Iron Mike said he had to think about what needed to be done before just letting us stay. Now we're trying to help out around the camp as best as we can. And Addie has asked us to go get her a Liston knife from Sherman's camp. Mind you, Sherman's camp is a very dangerous place. Um... It's uh, it's a very dangerous place. It's not safe. And uh, now we have to make our way over to Sherman's camp to continue this on. First thing I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to clear out nests. So I have to find my bike. There's my bike. We're going to grab the bike and we're going to go. Oh, it's you. Shut up, Buzz. All right, and we're off. We gotta go deal with this. So now we go out and we deal with this. Is anyone on this channel? O'Brien, is that you? Yes. Yeah, it's it's O'Brien. We still one of our radios. Good. Okay, look. I'm gonna try and help you find out about the woman. Sarah Whitaker. Put her on your chopper that night. Yeah, 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 I know, okay. But First, you gotta do something for me. Wait, what? You need something from me? Look, there's a digital display on your radio. I'm going to send you a coded message. Coordinates. Meet me at that location. O'Brien, what the hell is this all about? Just meet me there. There'll be Nero soldiers all around me like before. But don't let them see you. O'Brien out. Hold on, I never did finish burning out this nesting zone. Yep. And that's what we're gonna go do. Damn it, sniper ambush. St. John. <laughs> Copeland and Deacon St. John. We got a job for them. <laughs> They're down. <laughs> Someone's down. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, what, what were you saying? St. John. Copeland and Deacon St. John. We got a job for you. Hey, Copeland. Okay. Yeah, I'll stop by when I can. Deacon out. Ah, uh, you feel that, huh? Goddamn sniper. Well, that was fun. Fucking snipers. I hate them. Guess I'll come back later. Burn out these nests. Deke, this is Tucker. Stop by. I've got work for you. Yay. Hey, okay. I'll see if I can make time. Deacon out. Gotta go do work. We gotta do it for booze, man. That's what I said, right? <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and do that here in a second. I guess we'll um what we'll end up doing is we'll go ahead and this do... more than you. 
We'll do these jobs first for Tucker and Cope. Well, never mind. Guess we're going to do the infestation first so we can actually fast travel. Probably would be the smarter thing to do, if we're being honest here. Bike's over there and it's damn near wrecked. Uh. I can fix this. It should work. Takes four. Fucking ambush camps. We head into Sherman's camp. Here it is. So There's a freaker up there, okay. Come on, a little closer. More bounties. Visitor's center. Gotta find a way inside. For those of you who don't know, right there, Stellar's Sherman Camp Stellar Curiosities. That is where uh, a horde is. Is it? God damn, this has got to be close. Probably a mistake. Maybe I was wrong, maybe it's not there. Hmm. Door 
door's locked. Doors are locked and boarded up. It's been a while since I've done this. So trying to remember how to do it is the hard part. I'm not mistaken, maybe there's a lock that I gotta shoot. I was right, there's a lock. There we go. We figured it out. Fire escape. Nope. Down here. Not much left. This place has been picked over clean. Yep. A listed knife. There we go. We found Listed it. knife. This is it. Got to get it back to Addy. Definitely need to still clear out all these nests if we can. Addy, I got that knife you were looking for. Thank you, Deacon. You have no idea how badly we need this. No problem. Glad to help. There's the horde. Okay. This is where they come down to drink. Oh, I smell a nest. Gotta be right here. Smell it. Ugh, gotta be getting close. Yeah. There's a 
lot of them. That was fun. Definitely not what I wanted to do, but that horde's gonna start moving here soon, so we need to find this last one real fucking quick. Oh, this isn't fun. I got me fucking cornered. Found it. It's back over there. Already burned that old furniture store. Yeah. Now we just run down this way. Finished. Should be less freaks around here now. Now the goal is to get back to the bike without fighting anything else, because I really don't want to. Okay, so we did that. Good. We also got the Liston knife, which we were originally asked to get. The 
refill on gas and we'll head over to Cope's first. Now we fast travel over to Copeland. <sighs> I have a black loaf next to me. My cat sleeps with her feet under her completely. And when she puts her head down, she looks like a loaf. Like a loaf of pumpernickel. Deacon, just looking. St. John, I got a job for you. Cope. You want Manny to work on your bike? Only one way that's gonna happen. I gotta do runs for you. Yeah, I heard you. I need you to deal with a marauder camp near those burned out shacks along the Cascade Highway. You know where I'm talking about? Yeah, I know it. Radio me if you want to know more. So this is where we're going now. Hey. Hey. Haven't seen you around much lately. Thought maybe you'd gone up north without me. Jesse, no, no, we haven't gone up north. Boozer's, um... Boozer can't ride anymore. He's, uh, well, we're, we're, we're down at Lost Lake Camp, and I don't think that we're going anywhere. Jesus, Deke. Look, I'm sorry, I didn't know. I mean, I... I heard rumors coming in from the shit, you know, that Boozer was hurt or whatever, but I didn't know it was that bad. It was. Look, yep. uh, the offer stands. When we, if we head north to Smith Rock, you're coming with us. You got that? Yeah, Deke. Sure. Whatever you say, man. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, see you later. Here's some shrooms. All right, well, now we're going to go deal with a marauder camp. Cope Actually. says you've been helping out around the camp. I won't say it, but he appreciates it. Manny, is that all you need? I'll fix that gun up for you, nice and good. Come by any time. I'll be here if you need it. Hey. Hey, Manny. Uh, hold on a sec. I'll get it. Not going that way, dummy. Going this way. Hold on. I'll get it. I hope I'm heading to that drifter camp along the highway. What else can you tell me? 
Not much. They followed one of our supply runs. Got a little too close. I sent a man to check him out. He never came back. You sent anyone to find him? Yeah. A man named Deacon St. John. Cope out. Take a closer look. Which way? <sighs> You're mine now. Okay. Closer. I have a feeling we're gonna hit that snare trap here soon. Sent me. Come on, get up. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. They were following us on the supply run. I didn't know what to do. Hey, shut up. Can you run? What? Yeah, yeah. Well, then run. Go. Thank you. I'll tell Copeland you saved my life. That one's done. Next one we'll do is Tucker's. For now, we just gotta make it back to the bike. And then we'll head back to Cope's camp, spend some of our camp creds to upgrade the bike a little bit more. That sounds like a horde. Back to Cope's camp. Hold on, I know you. Open up. Hey, how's it going? That bike of yours. Need some fuel? No new engine, no new exhaust. Can get the saddlebag for 800. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Oh yeah, that's a good piece. 800 for a new fuel tank. We'll do good that choice, too. Good choice, man. Good choice. Can't do that yet. 900, 840. Definitely gonna get the tires first, and then we'll work on everything else. I'll be here. Hey. Don't be a stranger. Good to see you, dude. 
Very damn Hope you got some bounties for me. Okay then. Not much. Deke. I'll see you soon, right? That's it. Still not enough. Alright, well. Deke, how have you been? Damon. Now we'll ride all the way over here to good old Saloma Hot Springs. Let him help. I found your man. Is he alive? Barely. He's heading back to you on foot. You might want to send someone. I'll do that. Thank you, St. John. Copeland out. Deacon. Yeah? Going for a walk. Miss Tucker. Deke, we got a problem. Yeah, Tuck. What's up? You remember Alkai said that Rippers were spotted, heading our way? Yeah, I remember. He said he didn't try to stop them. Well, we've seen him scouting the hot springs. A couple of men followed him back to their camp, in the cliffs south of the Twin Craters. Goddamn Rippers. Don't worry about it. I'll take care of them. I got a score to settle. A score? What are you talking about? God, ne never mind. Bet you're here for your bike, right? Hey, Zanny, keeping your hands clean. Go here, right through the tunnel, and go straight to their camp. St. John, this is Mark Copeland. I just wanted to apologize for that business with your bike. After the things you've been doing to help out the camp, well, I guess I had you figured all wrong. Again, I'm sorry. St. John, this is Copeland. Manny says he's got a park for your bike. Not sure I have enough camp credits. When you do, swing by. He'll fix you up. Copeland out. Okay. Run all you want. I got you now. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. You wanna die out here? Look, there's a camp. Yeah, yeah. I'll go. I'll go. Yeah, now we need to send them to Iron Mike. Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. <laughs> Thank you. Cry, baby. Yeah, let him know it was Deacon St. John. Okay, keep running, stay out of sight.
It was just one asshole? Okay. None of you are getting out of here alive. Okay. Tucker, you there? You didn't gotta worry about that Ripper camp no more. I took care of him every last one of them. Nice job. Sounds like you did have a score to settle. Alkai said there's rumors going around that the Rippers are after the Biker Boys. Let's just say they fucked with the wrong guy, Deacon out. More rest in peace bullshit? Jesus, Carlos, practice what you preach and give it a rest. Well, that's another quest done for Tuck. Set up a couple bear traps killing the things that they fucking worship. A lot of people don't know that. That's why they look the way they look. Is they believe the freaks are the path that they're wanting to become a part of. And the freaks just don't care. The freaks see them and they go, ooh, food, yummy, let's eat.
very odd that there was only one wolf. Normally there's anywhere between two to three, so... Here we go. I have a feeling, as it's just me, that they're not... Either they got Good. killed by freaks, or they're somewhere around here. Um, let's go back to the hot springs. We got quite a bit of uh, camps that we could spend there. I said camps when I meant to say creds. My black loaf is sleeping. She's so cute with my baby. I'd say it's time to maybe start doing some horn hunting, but I don't, I, I don't know yet, you know? Hey, how's it going? Your bike could use some work. See ya! Well, if you could actually sell me parts, I'd consider that, but, you know, you don't, so I don't respect it. So, do me a favor and be hey, sure. Deacon. What? How's life as a camper, Alki? Same as ever? Gotta hurry up and get level 3 soon so we can get some of these better looking things. Good Refill rifle ammo. Yeah, get another primary suppressor. That. Another yeah. special suppressor. Need anything else? Thanks. There we go. Okay, sure. That's all I need from you, Alkai. Okay. Okay. We'll see you later. Come see me. That's everything there. Hey, a deacon, right? Sandy. So now. Ride back to here, and then we'll go meet up with O'Brien. So now we'll go in. One of the biker boys. Let him in. We need a couple of guys to get down the rest of the week's back. Got the bike off here. What do you call him? Hey. Hey there. <laughs> Got some ears here, okay. That's it for now. Ah, oh, okay. See ya. We got some wolves and we got some other things, so... Hey, uh, Where's hey. the cooking area? It's over here. That's right. So we'll drop some stuff off at the cooking area. It may or may not be enough to get us level up. Probably not. I'll just have to turn in the, um... You got something to say about it? Nice. Five wolf meat. That's, always That's good. all I got for now. Damn near close. It's got us up to 2170, so let's go... Turn in the stuff we need to do here, then we'll go out and do O'Brien. There we go. Should get us to at least level one. Hey. Oh, here's that knife you were looking for. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. There you go. So close. Oh, so close. New skill point. Good. Survival. We got these done. We've already got the butcher done. Um, we'll go ahead and grab this. So, this is also another mission we'll do after we do the O'Brien mission. The O'Brien mission needs to go first. Oh, it's you. You open or what? I'll fill her up. Okay. Go on. Get out of here. 
God, so aggressive. I haven't done anything wrong yet. Yet. <laughs> Brian now. It's a motherfucking bear. That's no good. Luckily, we're just going to stay away from the bear. Because why not? What we're trying to do is get a little bit more missions done. Hey, welcome to the stream. Before you leave a comment, I will respond as soon as I can. All right. Not too far away from where O'Brien is now. Yo, what up? What up, homie? You on your lunch break? Come to stop by and say hi to me on your lunch break? I appreciate it. For this to be done. I'm on my last break, currently going through a mood swing. All right, I'm here. Jesus, don't, don't sneak up on me like that. Oh, no. why are you going through a mood swing? What happened? Nothing. Nothing. Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. It's gonna take some time, okay? I'm risking my neck here. If anyone the, the back at HQ finds out, uh, the, those guys with the guns over there, they'll the order without the question. Team, right. Just looks that way. Look, I don't have time to explain. Side effects, I think. I Probably. Help. My help. Just, look, just take it. It's a, it's a wavelength recorder and some GPS trackers. I just need you to. We're out of time. Look. I... Shit, I don't even know your name. Deacon, Deacon St. John. Well, look, Deacon St. John, if you want me to risk my neck helping you find whatever her name, uh, Sarah, then, yeah, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. Let's go. Keep the radio close. I'll contact you in a couple of minutes. Okay. I feel unyielding rage right now. Has anyone pissed you off? And keep the radio close. It's been right here the whole time, you son of a bitch. Jesus Christ, how long do I have to wait now? Hello? Are you there, Deacon? Yeah, I'm here. Now, what's this all about? What do you want? All right, I put a blocker on this channel. It's secure. What do you want? I've sent a series of coordinates to your radio. I need you to go to those locations. What? Why? Then why don't you ask them? I can't. Look, I said it's a long story, and I don't have time to get into it right now. Let's just say the men above me, way above me, are running a lot of field missions. Nope. Just one minute, I'm happy. About to clock back in for lunch next minute, poof, angry. Yeah, that's how it happens sometimes. I sent you the coordinates. Okay, Jesus, O'Brien. Right. All right, I will see what I can do. LZs, landing sites, sample drop-off locations. Yeah, yeah, I got it, but you better have something for me, O'Brien. Yeah, yeah, I got it too. Hold on. All right, well, now we get to go. Yeah, that's how antidepressants and anxiety meds work, dude. O'Brien, yeah, I'm here. What do you uh? One of our helos is heading towards your position now. You have to follow it. Follow it? Why? Just, just go! Don't lose it! Jesus, okay. All right. What's going on, O'Brien? Why am I out here in the shit chasing choppers down for you? The destination's classified. This bad. Oh, man. So I don't want out another to one low. You have to follow low. Jesus, don't you guys have spy, spy satellites? Shit like that? Not that I have access to, no. I told you, I'm 
Locked out. Yeah, I heard you. Don't lose them. I still see them. Nothing to worry about, O'Brien. Come on now. Can't let them get too far ahead. Trying to best to make sure they don't. O'Brien, they're landing. Good. I have their coordinates now via your radio. You better go in on foot. On foot? Remember, you can't let them see you. O'Brien, I'm here. What do you want me to do? Each of these research units have a science guy, like me, guarded by a bunch of guards. I need you to get close to the researcher. The wavelength recorder is set to the channel we use to record data. You record everything you're doing. Squad channel. Okay, so you want me to sneak into an LZ filled with heavily armed Kevlar wearing soldiers who shoot on sight so that you can spy on some asshole wearing a pocket protector? A pocket protector? Really? I have a fucking PhD, asshole. Yeah, which stands for piled high and deep. Hey, you still have the tracking devices I gave you? Fine, we'll be gone. Well, I was gonna sell them, but most of us don't have access to shit like, you know, satellites. Place one of them on their helo. Wonder how long? Almost all of these filed missions include stops that aren't on the books. I'm gonna find out where they're going next. Brian. And you don't need to ask. I'm already looking at what records we have about where evacuees were taken. Yes, it will. Brian out. I know the silence. This is gotta be it. What the hell are you guys doing right here? while it was still alive. They're not my boys. What do you care? Aren't you a... What do you guys like to call yourselves? Drifters? Don't you kill the infected for money or whatever shit you partner with? Yeah, I kill freaks, but I don't carve them open while they're still alive and listen to them scream. Did you get my data? Yeah, I got your data. Alright, there okay. we go. That's what she's done now. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Brian. O'Brien. God damn it, he did it again. Well, Brian, talk to me. Shannon's not safe, dude. Oh, shit, you better be in touch, O'Brien. Oh, Marauder Camp. These are the assholes. Oh, Marauder Camp, you say? So we've been ambushing the roads around here. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. It's with a heavy heart. I report six deaths and two injuries from my camp this week. Yeah. All from the usual shit. No. But you murdering assholes can't chop your out of your life. Now I feel better, like it never happened. That's how it normally happens, dog. Heard those choppers touch down. Wiped out an entire Men coming here! Oh, 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 oh,
this country. And they are cut down. Never it's fun watching an animal kill this something for me, right? comes a bear. Let the bear care kill a couple of them for me. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> this is what happens. Yeah, oof is right. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. It's with a heavy heart. And I report six deaths and two injuries from my camp this week. Not from the usual shit. No. It was those damn black choppers. Let me tell you. Everything I've been telling you about is absolutely coming true. Heard those choppers touch down wiped out an entire group of men and women who were screaming and begging for mercy. Citizens of this country. And they cut them down. My men returned fire, but... Burn, you asshole. Shit, how you like killing drifts? This won't be the last we hear of them either. I like it now. They're hunting us down. Those of us who dared to survive and mess with their plans. They're killing us off so they can finally emerge from their gopher holes. Stay vigilant, people. And keep your eyes yeah. on the sky. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Lost one! You, out there, hiding! Come on out! How can you just cheese this? Uh, because I can. Thirteen. Come on, put your head back up. Hey, okay. How about no?
I got a use for you. Gotcha. Oh, I think that's it. Roads will be a little safer now. I mean, not much, but a little. Bunker, yeah, I bet they had a bunker. Just gotta find it. Yep, just gotta find it. Yeah, no, not gonna lie, Justin. I thought originally you were on your, your lunch, and I was like, damn, he showed up early for his lunch. Oh, great. Freakers are starting to come in. I am a little sad, though, because that bear meat would have been fucking mint at this point in time while trying to build up rep with Lost Lake. There it is. Down the hatch. Why would I in a second, Deke? I was taking it easy. Plus, I've been managing how I've been eating lately, so I took a nap. I don't want to be sitting there eating too much, you know? <laughs> That's a working toilet. Holy crap. A map. That was Looks dumb. Like I'm sorry. It up good. Damn, so close to having that first level done. A wrap, grapes, and some water. That's it. There you go. Don't need too much. All right. Let's go. Nap over. We're good. And my stomach is so angry with me. You're supposed to give me a Big Mac and a quarter pounder and burr, 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 burr. That's what your stomach's telling you. Your stomach's telling you, bitch, I need more. And you're like, no, stomach, you don't need more. And it's like, but I need it. It's killing me. Well, you gotta remember, thinning out the amount of food you eat helps you out in the long run because then you won't be so hungry all the time. You know what I mean? Oh, that almost hurt. what I wouldn't give for a burger. They're not happy I'm here. Hey, little shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was just funny to me. Roaring at my bike jumps on back. Hi, little shit. <laughs> okay. Nails. And you can tell someone was trying to build a camp here, and then it failed. Scrap? Always need scrap. I was right. Scrap. 
Scrap is awesome. Scrap is great. It's the reason why I can continue to live my life. Gotta go back to work. Ciao. Later, buddy. You have fun now. Don't go too crazy at work. And then there was one. There was in one by me. Give me some more scrap, please. Three that time. <laughs> All right, check around here real quick. Open this up real quick, see if it's scrap. It is, we're good. Load in the stream, feel free to leave a comment. I will respond as soon as I can. Okay, this has got to be it. Lisa, I'm coming for you. She's got to be out here somewhere. Fuck it. Take one down this way. Face the rest of them in melee. Ooh, I forgot that you were really weak. I already spiked that. There we go. We're good. Five to kill here? Great. Alright. Where are you, kid? Come on then. Got you.
What I need now is some kerosene and rags. Excuse me. Is that a god scrap? Nice to find some kerosene, you know. Yo, what up? Basically, lol. It's killing me. I know, but what I wouldn't give for a burger. Gotta <laughs> go back to work, ciao. Map. Oh, how the hell am I going to get in? <gasps> Through here, yeah, this will do it. Inside here. There we go. This is handwriting. I want to forget. Oh, that sounds like something she would write. Okay, well, we found something about Lisa. Okay, there we go. Oh, God, I need to stretch my legs real quick. Give me a second, guys. Uh, we got Burley Lake infestation still to do. We have the infestation over here. All right, we just got a lot to work on. God damn it. Oh, I should have just started shooting, to be honest. Would have been better.
Open sesame, please. So hard. Thank you. That did it. the bounty. Nails. Can make something out of this. Molotov, which is always good. Find some kerosene in here to make more A, like I said. That's all you gotta do. You just gotta look around. I will head over to the Mount Scotch grocery store. Bless you. Bless you. If you sneeze one more time, somebody's talking about you. Bless you. Who the fuck's talking about you? It's not me. I'm just sitting over here going, try my best. I 
Have I been in here yet? I think I have. I'm dead. <laughs> this game sucks. I'm joking. I'm joking. This game doesn't suck. I just keep dying because I suck. I'm excited to walk out of this fucking house and go, oh, I can totally do it. Oh, God damn you. I didn't want to have to Scrap. and do this. I know I should have quick saved up my bike. I can't believe I died with bear again. Her fucking bears. This is why I wish I had my BFG, bro. Hopefully the bear didn't spawn in on this run through. 
And if it did, I'll just quick save, you know? Just was not expecting the bear to show up and say, hey, how's it going? I'm here to ruin your day. And I'm like, oh, okay. Well, great. My day's been ruined. Thank you, Mr. Bear. Not seeing the bear. It's a quick save with triangle. And we still have three more nests left to deal with. In you go. to do and a chest full of a medkit. Great. I can't pick that up yet. It's fine. I smell it. <sighs> it's gotta be getting close. Isn't that how it normally is? There we go. Bike's been refilled. Now we can go ahead and do the loot game. Can't loot that. Okay. You're broken. I need more scrap and I can't get it. This is bullshit. here that's upsetting let's go upstairs real quick a singular bottle if that's it i'm heavily disappointed <gasps> oh i'm heavily disappointed <clears throat> i was at least expecting some scrap but it doesn't look like any of these cars can be you know torn into for scrap but hey there's kerosene Oh. 
All right, guess we're gonna head back to Lost Lake now. Uh, let's see. Don't care. 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 I heard that and I completely disagree. Hey, we don't want any trouble. I worked at the Humane Society, had a small office. Had maybe a hundred dogs. Strays mostly. Hey, hey. I saw Boozer the other day. Your friend, right? Man, that's pretty messed up what happened to him. Yeah, yeah, it is. I heard it was rippers. Is that true? That did it to him, I mean. Yeah, it was rippers. Look, can we just... Can we not talk about it? Uh, yep. yep. Alright, well, I just yelled at a dude for no reason other than the fact that he mentioned a booze man. Which I agree with, dude. Good job. Good job setting your foot down. Fuck that. They don't even know. <laughs> All right, so I guess let's go to the gun shop first, and then we'll head over to the bike shop. Hello. Hello, Hello. lady. Ooh, that's nice. We're no, gonna take that. I'm not vouching for that. <sighs> nice. Alright, locker. Still gonna keep the stinger as my primary. Sidearm, we'll leave it the way it is. And uh, yeah, the C8 rifle will be good. Alright. Let's go Thanks work on the bike. Back. Don't get in my way. How's it going? Hey, how's it going? Shit. Looking for anything in particular? Good piece. Nice and sturdy. You deserve it. Yeah, that'll last you. Okay. Where's the screwdriver? Got fuel if you need it. Bike's looking pretty busted. Sure. All right. All right. Oof. All right, now let's go see Boozy. Booze man, I'm coming. Hey. Came by to see how the lazy bastard's doing. How you doing, uh, Booze Man? Are you are you tired of laying around yet, yeah, Boozer? Hey, you can't be in come here, on, Deacon. Come on, hey, come what's on, going Deacon. on? How's he doing? He needs his rest. Uh, don't mess around with me, Eddie. I asked you, how is he doing? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, not good. Uh, it's cold. Yeah, uh, they're not know. enough. <laughs> Never oh, wait a second. You said that I, I said that we would try. <sighs> Look, all we can do is wait. Uh, wait. Okay. All right. Deacon, Deacon, no, Deacon, there's. Uh, you Deacon, know what? There's something I can do Deacon, about Deacon, this. Stop, I can get. Stop! What? I know you want to smash something. I see that look yes. in your eyes. Well, you know what? You go right ahead, but you do it out there. Daddy, go. I can... Look. <sighs> there is nothing else you can do. Please. Just go home. Go home, Deacon. Deacon, Deacon. Who's man ain't doing good? So yeah, Schizo, he'll be fine. I just, he needs a few days. Come with me to the lodge. I want to show you something. I got shit to do. I'm sticking my neck out here. Trust me. You're going to want to see this. 
Just, just listen. A couple of months back, this drifter comes into camp, telling all kind of crazy stories. Said he worked at the airport, was on the ground back in Farewell when shit went down. One night, they were expecting a flight in from Portland. Only it never shows up. The plane was doing a haul for the Red Cross. The Red Cross? Yeah. You getting it? Medicine, doctor shit, cargo hold full of it. Maybe even some of those uh, anti uh, whatever the fucks. Antibiotics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit like that. Just like that. Where? Hey, keep your voice down, will you? Let's talk inside. So this drifter is working in the control tower when the plane disappears off the radar. Poof. Now you see it. Now you don't. Right about here. South of Mount Washington. That's what he said. It came down intact. A controlled crash or whatever. The guys got to listen to the pilot bleeding out from a broken pelvis on the ground. Okay, so you haven't sent anyone to find this? Nope. Why not? Because the old man won't have it. Iron Mike, what's... Oh, right. Rippers. <laughs> you catch on quick. Everything west of the Iron Ridge here belongs to Carlos and his merry band of bald-headed freak alikes. Oh, shit. So you go over there and you get caught. You head north, brother. Otherwise, Iron Mike's treaty with rest and peace goes... <laughs> ah, no, no, like no, I get it, I get it. Let me ask you a question. Why are you telling me this? Oh, wait a minute. First off, I'm not telling you shit. You remember that? Yeah. Second off, you're a goddamn drifter. What am I supposed to do? Follow you around like I'm your little bitch, keep your ass out of trouble? All right. I have things to do. I get it. You're just a regular stand-up guy, right, Schizo? Just trying to stay alive. Like everybody else. <sighs> hey. You do what you gotta do. At the end of the day, that's all we got. Do you know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying, Schizo. Keep your radio close. I'll be in touch. <laughs> Sorry if you can hear uh, dark in there. D dark, Jesus. I am live. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, Schizo, we can always count on you. Oh shit, now what? Anything's better than standing around this shithole. All right. Well, our bike has been fixed up. What do you need? Homie, I'm... Alright, and now you're definitely not getting me. Daddy ain't nobody's fucking meat shield. <laughs> Use Olivia. She's better at it. That's why I said use Olivia. You know, instead of running away from her, just stay right on her butt the whole time. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to find something to eat because the boy is hungry. And since Stark's beautiful fiance was nice enough to leave some food behind, I'm going to eat it. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Pop this in the microwave for 30 seconds, and then it should be ready to eat. Okay. 
Hmm. Well, it sounds like Dark's wanting me to go join him on, uh, on, um, some Fortnite. So I think I might actually end the stream here and go join up with him and have some fun with him. Um, I do believe he is streaming, so if he is, come over to his channel and you'll hear me over there. With all that being said, thank you guys for tuning into the stream, and I will see y'all next time. Remember, your blood is your honor, my friends. And since you made it to the end of the video, your honor has been redeemed. Mayo Bunkite.